At Nettleville Lumber Company, it all starts in the woods. We deal with private landowners and by standing tracks of timber that is available. Our forests are specialized in finding nice tracks of aged hardwood that can be select cut. Our logging crews are one of the best around in select cutting. Select cutting deals with cutting only aged timber in order for the land to be properly managed for the next generation cutting. Once the hardwood leaves the woods, it is delivered straight to Nettleville Lumber Company where it will begin its process of becoming quality lumber. Our log trucks travel in excess of a 120 mile radius in order to complete the hauling process. Once the logs arrive at the mill, they are scaled to specific milling specs and cut with our Tiger Cat knuckle boom to specific length. In order to do the milling process, the logs have to be ran through our Nicholson ring debarker, which is immediately followed by a journey through our MDI metal detector in order to detect any objects that could damage our bandsaws. After completing the debarking stage, the logs travel to our head rig, which is a coily manufactured carriage. The carriage is designed to square the log into a camp using a six-foot McDonald band mill in order for the process to continue to the line bar. Once the logs arrive at the line bar, it is processed by cutting the grade out of the log and keeping the log on heart center, which is the responsibility of the sawyer. The line bar is designed to make a single cut at a time, but is able to return until the can is squared into a four by six. The line bar is capable of sending the lumber into numerous places, such as the trimmer, the edger, or the resaw. Once the logs leave the line bar, they are now considered lumber. One place the lumber could be routed to is our high-tech optimized edger, which is responsible for properly edging our lumber to the specific parameters. Another possible route for our lumber to go is to our high-tech optimized trimmer, where the lumber is then trimmed to a specific length. After being trimmed to a specific length, it is then sent to our NHLA certified lumber inspector in order to be separated into the correct solder bay. When the solder bay is full, it is then dropped onto another chain, which is delivered to the stacker, where it will be placed on stacking sticks. The lumber would then be dipped in our insecticide tank. After the dipping process is done, the lumber is then placed on our yard in order to dry for three months. After the three month air drying process is done, the lumber is then taken to the dry kilns for several weeks to allow the lumber's moisture to be removed to a specified level. It is then taken from the dry kilns to the lumber inspection chain be thoroughly inspected by one of our NHLA certified lumber inspectors. After being inspected, it is then pulled to a specified bay which is determined by the grade of the lumber. In the lumber grading process, the lumber inspector looks for defects and ripping options that have to be cut out of the lumber in order to improve the overall grade of the lumber. What separates Fred out of a lumber from other sawmills is that we can take it from the forest to the finished product. Our distribution division is equipped with state-of-the-art millwork facility where we can complete any job required by any cabinet shop, millwork, company, or retail lumber yard. In distribution business, service is a top priority. Our team of experienced professionals are committed to provide the best possible service in the industry. Here at Fred Nettleville Lumber Company, our goal is to be the most vertically integrated sawmill in the country, from logs to lumber to your doorstep.